ओके सो हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आवर टॉपिक इज द एनरिच मीडिया एंड द एनरिचमेंट मीडिया सो व्हाट इज द मेन डिफरेंस मेन डिफरेंस इज एनरिच मीडिया इज सॉलिड एंड एनरिचमेंट मीडिया इज लिक्विड दिस इज द मेन डिफरेंस ऑफ एनरिच मीडिया एंड द एनरिचमेंट मीडिया सो फर्स्ट वन इज एनरिच मीडिया एनरिच मीडिया इज सॉलिड मीडिया first point next point added nutrients to allow growth of the fastidious organisms so let's see the example first one is blood agar blood agar is produced by 5 to 10 percent of sheep sheep blood okay next one is chocolate agar chocolate agar is just the heating the blood agar and rbc will be break will break down and intracellular nutrients will be released so this is this is a chocolate agar and next one is lss that is low flood serum slope so this is the enriched media next one is enrichment media as we tell that this is the always liquid always will be liquid and for the specimens which have normal flora common cell reasonable stool and sputum so mainly we uh, culture this for this so now is have substances which allow pathogens to grow and inhibit the common cells examples are alkaline pepton water for vivio species selenite broth for salmonella and sigella you can remember here is for is for selenite broth is for salmonella is for sigella okay next is uh, tetrathionate broth that is for salmonella and next one is gram negative broth for sigella okay so that's it for the the lecture of english media and enrichment media so guys if you like this video then please do not forget to hit the like button and please do subscribe